Yo guys, what is up? Welcome to DigiDaily. I'm your host, Xanadu, and today's gonna be another chill episode. I must admit, I haven't, uh, I haven't battled them much. I don't want them to die. Uh, I'm still bummed out about Doro Um, so I haven't been doing much battles, and I don't want to show off the battles on camera now, because none of them will be stuff that we haven't seen. All of it will just be the early stuff. I didn't get very far when they were, uh, uh, evolving because I was in such a rush to get the drug rests because I was so excited. Can you hear my dogs in the background? They're outside enjoying the nice, the nice warm weather. Uh, today is actually nice, good spring-like weather, and I'm very excited. Um, I, 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 I want to get out of here <laughs> immediately uh, and do something because it's such. I, th I don't think we've had nice weather like this. It, it feels like it's been forever, so I really want to take advantage of that. Um, so today's episode is not going to be a long one, not, uh, no siri, probably another, like, quick five minute video again, because, uh, yeah, I am very, very anxious to get out of this house, because, again, nice day outside. But I do want to show something off, I want to kind of do some preliminary, uh, some things that I have to do, or I want to do, really, was what I should say, some things I want to do, uh, to get ready for the next run, uh, and that would be copying over a Digimon. So let's show that off again, just in case anyone doesn't know how the copying mechanic works. Oh, the poor thing. Doro Greymon. Uh, so I want to copy over. I skipped over him by accident. I want to copy over Slayer Digimon. And I go here. I go to the two guys who want to fight each other. I go down here. Go to the nope. I go to the last one. This is copy. That says copy. Let's connect them. And there we go. Should be good. Yep. Okay. As you see, C1. It's Slayer Digimon. I can copy another Digimon over too, but I don't think I don't have to. I don't, well, I don't, I don't have anyone. I, I haven't. I want to copy over. If you copy a Digimon, you want to see. Or remind yourself who it is. You go to the book. You go to the second. Excuse me. You go to the second option, and it'll show you C1. Uh, you only have two slots for copy Digimon. C1 and C2. When you use a copy Digimon for jaw dressing, it'll go away. So uh, on both of these, on this one, uh, did I copy someone over on this one? Yeah, Aegistramon on this one is uh, is gone. No, Aegistramon on this one. Is, uh, is gone. He's not on this device anymore because he's been used uh, as a jog race. And that's how the copy system works. But also, uh, in other news, there's some news coming out apparently, but I, I haven't I haven't seen any. So either it's coming out later on tonight, um, or I don't know, either it's, it's supposed to come out later on tonight or something because we're, we're getting the last bit of Pendulum 20th news today i believe or maybe it already came out and i just didn't see it because no one's been talking about it but i, I doubt it came out because usually we i see it somewhere um but uh i believe yesterday was the last day to pre-order your pendulum 20ths uh so the pre-orders have been closed um if you're still looking for one you might be able to find some slot like they they might still have some up for pre-order like on you know, various websites like, um, uh, what, Day Japan, Japan you want. I don't know, I haven't checked personally, but they might still have some. Uh, if you're still interested and you're like, oh no, I missed the, uh, you know, I missed the, uh, the time. I have money now, but I didn't have money yesterday or whatever. I would still check Japan you want because they will sometimes, um, still have slots open because people cancel. Um, you know, people don't pay or whatever, so sometimes they'll have pre-orders go back up or, or, you know, orders go back up. And when they do go back up, they're not at, like, a jacked up price. They're still the same price as it would be, like, normally. That's actually how I got this one. Uh, I got this after the fact. I, I didn't even pre-order this. Um, I never pre-ordered the Wave 2, so when that came out, I was kind of bummed out. And then I had money, and I was like, huh, you know what, I wonder if I can get a Wave 2. So, just by chance, I went on from, uh, I went on, I went on just by chance I went on Japan you want and there we go it was there and it was for I believe it was like $60 but it was like free shipping so normally uh, you would pay like 50 plus like 10 shipping so it was it pretty much worked out uh, and yeah 
that's how I got my Wave 2. Uh, and occasionally, on Japan you want, they'll have the wave, some Wave 2s on there. Mostly the Zubamon color. I guess that one didn't sell as well, or a lot of people canceled that one. Uh, and they just have, like, you know, excess. But uh, I never see them... Well, I mean, I could be wrong. I haven't checked the prices recently. But they were selling these for, you know, a fair price. They weren't selling these for, like, a really high um, margin. So, you might get lucky again with the Pendulum 20s once those, you know, come out too. You might, you know, so don't don't give up. Still check out there. Just pay a, a fair price. Don't, like, jump on the first thing you see just because it's there, and but it costs, like, you know, $100. Like, I, I wouldn't do that. I would definitely kind of try to um, find a better deal unless you just really, really, really want one and you're willing to pay that price. Um, but, uh, yeah. That's going to be all for today, guys. I know, I'm, I'm sorry that these episodes haven't been really long. Um, I just don't want to fall into a rut with this, like, where it's like, oh, here are they, we show battles, and, like, I, I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out what I can do with the formula of DigiDaily, um, because I, I don't want it to become, like, it's been going on for a while, you know, this is the 53rd episode, I believe? 52nd, 53rd, I think, and, uh, that's a lot of, that's a huge backlog of videos that people can watch, but also for people who have watched that and are watching currently, I don't want it to just be constantly the same thing, because it's kind of boring, I don't want to do, you know, a hundred days of the exact same video, uh, I do want to kind of switch it up, so I'm trying to figure out how I can recalibrate the series and make it a bit more interesting and different um, and and more interactive too I just like I, I just I, I can't think of anything that would make digi daily itself interactive I know how to make other things I do on my channel a bit more interactive but not digi daily yet unless again they add some kind of online battling function which is not the case at the moment um, so yeah actually Okay, I might have thought of something. I'll, I'll probably, I'll work on it. I'll sit on it. I just had an epiphany. I'll write it down and I'll sit on it. I'll mention it tomorrow's episode. Um, but I will say this for this video. Um, if you're watching this, if you love DigiDaily, if you love Digimon, if you love raising Digimon and the V-Pets, etc., etc., in the comments below, or I'll put up like a poll, if you have an Android phone, uh, answer yes or no. Um, I, I don't think it matters how old your Android phone is. As long as you have one. So if you have an Android phone, uh, comment or click yes on the poll. And, uh, yeah. I'll try to see what I can do from there. So, yeah, let's make this a little bit more interactive. And, uh, how can I, how did I not even think of that in the first place? That's besides the point. I'm going to go so I can work out these kinks and figure out how I can do this series now. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, peace.